Hi, my name is Rachel Ewens. I'm a mobile strategist and I run the app blog ladyappapp.com. And I want to talk to you about how to enlarge apps on an iPad. Now, um, not all iPad apps will work on iPhone, but all iPhone apps will work on iPad. And to get the best view of them, you need to enlarge them. So all iPhone apps will work on an iPad. Uh, you just have to stretch them a little bit. So we'll click on this one. Cloth is an iPhone app. It's intended for iPhone. Um, so when you click on it, it's going to appear small like this. It's usable, but it's kind of tiny. It's not a great way to look at it. So to make it big, like I just had it, you're going to actually look in the lower right hand corner. You're going to see down here a really teeny tiny 2x. When you hit the 2x, it's going to multiply the size. If you want to make it small again, so it looks like on your iPhone, you can hit the 1x again. It'll work just like a normal app. It's just stretched out a little bit. Now, another really good tip is when you're shopping for apps, to look for apps that have a plus sign in the corner. This means they're universal apps. And when it's a universal app, it's an app that's designed to work on both an iPhone and an iPad. So actually the way it's made is that they double the assets. So it's basically the same function, but it'll work perfectly on both devices and look great. So some of the apps may not look their best on your iPad because of the dif difference in pixel density from the iPhone to the iPad. But my name's Rachel Ewens, and this has been how to enlarge apps on your iPad. Thank you.